Cape Breton's largest retail space is covered in a blanket of heavy snow. The Mayflower Mall closed on Wednesday after receiving another major dumping only a week after a record-breaking 150 centimeters. Sam Bootler and his wife are the owners of Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory. We've had a really uh, discouraging month. We, uh, we were closed for almost a week uh, due to weather when we had the 150 centimeters of snow. And then we just missed Valentine's. We were open on the 13th of February. We got a full day in, but then on the 14th it was closed and we've been closed ever since. Bootler says mall management have been keeping tenants and customers up to date on the cleanup through their Facebook page. But he says the communication has been a little sparse. I'm thinking it's because they're really busy and they're trying to keep us safe, which I understand and I appreciate. In a post made yesterday, mall management said they were beginning to slowly open stores, but were also being mindful of heavy snow loads. It's not clear whether those were concerns related to the building's roof. The mall also hired an engineer and shovelers. CBC News left several messages for the mall's management team, but they were not returned. I'm hoping that things are going to cool down. And it was the pandemic, it was Fiona, it was uh, the rising food prices, it's uh, rising interest rates. We need a break. So hopefully it's on the way. Bootler says because so many of his products are made fresh in store, it can be difficult to open on short notice. He's now hoping for a much better Easter season so he can try and make up for some of this year's losses. Erin Potty, CBC News, Sydney.